Ugh, I'm gonna kill myself. Why? <coughs> it's been like a month and I haven't stopped Won't coughing. You take some cough medication. We're gonna make a dessert who has the name of a European capital. Okay? So don't ask me why this is a Greek thing, but don't ask me why they name that. I have no idea. So what's the capital of Denmark? Copenhagen? Yeah. That's what the name is. Copenhagen. We need one and a half cup crushed almonds. This is almonds, okay? Half a cup of sugar, half a teaspoon cinnamon, four or five tablespoons the juice of a squeezed orange, six eggs, six egg yolks, and six whites. I have them separate here, okay? Six whites. One teaspoon baking powder, and this. You don't have to put the same thing there. You're not gonna have a Greek store around you, but put a breadcrumbs, crushed, fine. <coughs> Three fourths of a cup, I like to put a cup. I put a cup. Put your butter outside, sweet butter the night before. It's not spoiled. I wanna put two sticks of butter there. And also, you need, where's the phyllo? What did I do with it? Oh, here. Also, you need a uh, phyllo number four, but if you don't have it, you can make it in your own, in your supermarket. You can find the international section there, and they have, you can do it with a pie crust or anything you like, but it's supposed to be good. Wipe I, this off your face. Well, what it was. I never made it before, okay? So we'll see. <coughs> Good God. I'm going to beat the th six egg whites with a mixer, hand mixer, and a little bit of salt, and I'm gonna make it thick, okay? You have to make it thick. This, I'm gonna beat it for five, five good minutes until it gets thick. It doesn't take that long to do it. Make sure it's thick. Make sure it's thick, see? Like this. It doesn't take that long. Give me that red ball up there. This one. Not this, the other one, the big one. Yeah. What? No, the big one I said! What the? I don't have time to fool around. The other one. That, no! <laughs> Just give me that. No! Okay, that's it. I get it. I get it. I'm sick of you. Forget it. Just forget it. Uh, whip the uh, butter with the, with the egg yolks and the sugar. That's it. I'm going to add the dry ingredients, okay? So I'm gonna do first the um, almonds, the breadcrumbs. breadcrumbs, make sure it's unflavored breadcrumbs, the baking powder, powder, cinnamon, and the orange juice. So much for it being dry ingredients. So. Now, we're going to mix good. So is this gonna come out like a cake? Yeah, I never make it before. I ate it though. I ate it in Athens. <laughs> but I never make it. it. Smells good already. Okay, now I'm gonna melt the butter because I'm gonna put the filo dough, like seven, eight layers filo dough, and I have to brush each one in the pan with the butter. So. What, wait, 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 wait. Where, where, which part of that are you cooking? Just the corner or? Uh, <laughs> Why don't you move it it's so it's fine. Over the, the, the fire go, we go there. What's with you? Why? Why? Like I said, Fox, I never made this before, but it looks fine to me. <laughs> <coughs> oh, I'm gonna get you cough medicine. Okay. 
it's mixed good. What I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna add the um, egg whites so we make it fluffy, hopefully. I'm gonna squeeze a little more on it. It doesn't have seeds, so. Who come up with this idea, I don't know. No flour, no flour. And we have syrup to do. I have everything ready, I'll show you later. A ton of sugar in there. Well, you know, like I say, you don't need Is this, this. a Greek recipe? It's in a Greek book. But why this name? Why? They name it Copenhagen. I never heard. My kitchen bath? My God. Guys. We start like As always, thing. when you have uh, filo yeah. dough, you brush every layer with butter, including the very bottom of the pan. Oh yeah, definitely. Maybe you shouldn't miss a huge spot. It's fine. No, oh, for yeah. God's sake, I don't have time. Come on. Oh hey, good, the filo is good. If you've seen the other videos with filo dough, you know you how know, this goes. You know how it goes. Brush goes. every yeah. single layer with melted butter, including the very top as well. You brush too hard. I wonder Three. if regular grocery stores have phyllo dough. It used to. They have si something similar to it. I don't know. Okay. I have three. We done the bottom. Here I am. I'm missing my stories. Now, this goes in. Yeah. Now I'm gonna cover with the rest of it, okay? Brush again with butter. You put eight layers on top? Yeah, I'm gonna, I don't want the top to make it too thick. Well, how many are you gonna put? I'm gonna put either seven or eight. Okay. I'll see how many. Anyways, you'll see the idea. Yeah. Just keep doing this for seven or eight layers. Okay, now, I think we are done with this. I'm gonna pour a little bit of butter on top, not all of it guys, okay? Just a little bit. That's enough. Sprinkle with a little bit of water so it doesn't rise up. You know, I should have a little sprayer. My hand is clean, but still it's not presentable. Okay, good enough. 350 degrees, bake it for 40 minutes. That's it. Now, we have syrup. After it is cool off a little bit, not entirely cold, but I have here two cups of sugar, one cup of water, and the juice of a half lemon. The lemon juice is because you don't wanna caramelize. You know, if you don't put it, it might, you know, caramelize. So. Now we're gonna take a little break. I'm gonna clean up here. I'm going to boil the syrup before the dessert is out for five to 10 minutes. You okay. could have put uh, a quarter of that sugar in there and it still would taste the same. I didn't put an, a lot of sugar in yes, there. Yes, you did, that's huge. Well, what do you want me to do? That's what I it told says. you, cut it way down. Uh, Okay, this is, oh my God, this is done. Oh Lord, this is done. Let's turn this off too. I did it, but I forgot to cut it. Oh, after mm -hmm. I do with that. You cut it before you cook it? Yes, what's just the, like what's this. What's the difference? It's just something, you know, I, I don't know what's the difference, but it's some difference. Oh God. I doubt it makes a difference. All these crazy steps in these cooking recipes and most of them you can probably cut out. I should have cut. See here, here, I should have cut it with a knife. Doesn't matter. Damn, you have the knife and you cut it not too much, maybe about one eighth of an inch. Darn it. And how long did you boil the syrup? 
about 10 minutes. My recipe doesn't say let it cool off and put the syrup on it. So she says, after you take it out of the oven, put the syrup on it, and when it cools off, then you cut it. Well, let's see. Oh, God, I should have cut it. Just pour the whole pot. Oh my goodness, you actually listened to me. Hey, done. It smells good though. Hey, you can cut it. Yeah, you have to cut it before you. Yeah. And let it then go in. And you go just. Oh my goodness. That's it. No flour. I never seen anything like this before. Don't ask me why. I don't know why. It's a cloud in the sky. You let it cool off and cut it. But always we don't have the time. I can't wait to... I haven't eaten this since I was a little girl. Nice. Oh, look at this. Well, you never know. This is not... Wait, 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 hold it right here. Okay, look. Get the spoon out of the way. This is... Wait, 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 hold it where we were. This is not bad. It turned yeah, out good. perfect. Okay, so we eat now? Yes. Wow, let's see. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, it's good. It's like, what are you doing? This is good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I bet you, when it cools off, it will be, you know, much better. Mm -hmm. Boy, I have a lot of cleanup to do. This is good. Let it cool off and enjoy it, okay? You might like it, you might not, but it, I'm telling you, it's really, really good. It's very different. If you don't have filo, use something else. Enjoy it, try it, share with a friend, subscribe, um, like, click comment. like, or favorite, and just enjoy it. It's a really good thing. <coughs> mm. Mm-hmm.